Hi, I'm Michelle, one of Questacon's Excited Particles. Have you ever seen one of these? They're called a lava lamp because they look like bits of multicolored volcanic lava swirling around. I'm going to show you how to make one, minus the volcano. You will need a plastic bottle, water, vinegar, food coloring, oil, bicarb soda, citric acid, and a spoon. First, add a few drops of food dye into your water. Today I'm using red. Then, carefully pour the water into the bottle until it's full about a quarter of the way. Then, add your vinegar into the bottle until it's about half full and give the bottle a gentle swirl. Now this is the tricky part. Carefully pour the oil on top of the water vinegar mix until it gets close to the top. Oil is less dense than water, so the oil rests on the surface. Take a little bit of your citric acid and sprinkle it into the bottle. Add a spoonful of bicarb soda. Drop it in carefully. And give it a bit of a tap to help it all pass through the oil. Bicarb soda and citric acid chemically react with the vinegar in the water, creating bubbles of carbon dioxide. This gas is less dense than either the water or the oil, and so it rises up through both liquids. When the gas passes up through the water into the oil, it pulls a small amount of water with it. Eventually, these bubbles reach the top, they pop, and the water falls back down through the oil. And there you have it, your very own lava lamp. If you'd like some more Excited Particles action, head to the Questacon website, where science is fun. See you next time.